willing would you be to donate food to those in need if it was just picked up right from your mailbox? Well, you can do that this weekend. 21 Alive's Jessica Walter has all the details this morning. Hi, Jessica. Hey, Kayla and Julian, it's time for the annual Stamp Out Hunger Food Drive with the Associated Churches. We're here with Roger. Tell me a little bit about what this food drive means for you guys. Well, the food that will come in this warehouse will really take us into the fall. And uh, I'm not sure what we would do without the letter carriers coming together in a wonderful way that they make it happen. And this community responds in a big way. And you just said letter carriers. We have one here with us. You guys are kind of the ones who facilitate all of this. You kind of do all the heavy, heavy lifting here. Tell me what that means for you guys. Yeah, we plan this way in advance. We look forward to it. Um, the letter carriers are ready to go. We have volunteers, hundreds of volunteers that help out um, to pick up food on Saturday morning. So the community, everybody can be a part of this. And uh, we love our communities. We, we love the folks that we deliver mail to. And it's a way we can give back and everybody can participate and put the food out and we will pick it up on Saturday morning. And you said Saturday morning. What if someone maybe does it Friday morning if they're gone on Saturday? What about Sunday? Or, well, I guess no mail Sundays. But can people still donate? Will you guys still pick it up if they're not right on time? Absolutely. We really would like the food out Saturday. Um, if you think you might be gone Saturday, put it out Friday night. It'll be fine. And we'll pick it up. Um, if you forget, we'll, there's always some that we pick up during the week, the following week, but yeah, you're good. Okay, <laughs> so I understand you guys should all be getting little cards in the mail. Some of your mailmen will be putting out bags in the, in the mailboxes even, but it's such an easy way. You don't even have to leave the house and you can share a meal with someone right in your community that you may not even know. All right, Jessica, it's so easy. And, you know, Tim was mentioning they have hundreds of volunteers to help with the food collection. Do they still need volunteers? They are wondering if you guys still need any volunteers to help. Yes, we do. <laughs> yes, we still need a few volunteers that can help out. And it could just be an hour or uh, uh, a couple hours. Uh, you can pick uh, how you'd like to uh, to volunteer. So yes, and contact us at Associated Churches, um, associatedchurches.org, or give us a call. Okay, it's really that easy. It sounds like they really could use your guys' help. Yeah, even just one hour of your time. Exactly, so easy. Jessica, thank you so much for that live report.